Hey everyone, welcome to another video of mine. In this one, we are going to see how to set up almost every electronic Armiton watch that's out there. So let's begin with setting up the most important functionality of this watch, that's the date, date and time. So for that, long press the set button. It would basically tell the watch that we want to set up one of its components. So the first one that you're going to see blinking here are the seconds. And basically the adjust button is used to adjust whatever is blinking right on the screen and the mode button is basically to navigate all the function of the watch so if I click mode once now here the hours button is blinking so I can use the adjust button to set up the hours right now like that if I'm happy with the hours I can use the mode button to move forward this is the day and the date functions Right now you see on my left, the day part of it is blinking which you can easily set using the adjust button. I'll just show you once more. Now when we go ahead with the mode, right now you see the day is blinking and we'll try to press mode once more. And now you see here the format, whether you want a 12 hour or a 24 hour format. So if I pressed once, I'll get to 24 hours and if I press it again, it'll switch back to the 12 hours. Pressing on mode again once we are back to the seconds blinking right now we are happy with the overall day date and time so if you're done with that we'll press the set once to come out now let's go through the other modes of watch and try to set them as usual we'll click on the mode to see the function of the watch now here we have the stopwatch and to begin this we'll just click the adjust button once so this will start the stopwatch and to stop it we'll press the same button once and if you want to reset it we just click on the set button and it will come back to the zero position going to the next mode here we have the alarm as you can see by these initials al now the setting up of the alarm is same as how we did the time it's very easy we begin with pressing the set button for a bit more than two seconds and once you see the hours blinking we can change it using the adjust button right here and if you want to switch between these timings we just click on mode right here and there are basically two alarms so if there's like a t1 and there's a t2 so you can set up to two alarms in this watch and if you're happy with all the settings you just click on set once so once it's set we click the adjust button once more and you see here the alarm sign comes out and for the first time when I pressed it what it basically did was it switched on the chime so that's one of the other functions that this one does so moving on to the next mode that we have this one is a timer button that's basically a countdown so right now it's set to 4 minutes 40 seconds and if I click on adjust or start it basically starts counting down so you see the seconds decreasing right here now if i want to stop this i'll just press the adjust button once more and to set this again similar to how we have set up the date or time before long press the set button and you see all the modes here blinking and if you're happy you click the set once more and you are done moving along to the other modes of the watch so the last one is the second time zone and it's also one of the convenient features of the watch where you can set it up and it's same as time zone 1 where you long press the set button until one of the modes get blinking and you scroll through the modes like usual and you use the adjust button to set it's pretty basic and easy so guys i hope you like this short video of an armitron watch setup uh, the other videos that i looked on the internet are pretty long and you have to wait through and sit through all of it to know how exactly your watch works which shouldn't be the case so like share and don't forget to subscribe for interesting videos coming up next week